Hello everyone, this is Leola Grove and I'm back again. And today I have my makeup on except my eyes. So I'm going to show you how I do my eyes. And I'm 72 years old and who says you can't wear eyeshadow? I do wear eyeshadow and I'm gonna show you how I put it on. Okay, are you ready? Here we go. All right, first I'm gonna take a light color. This is what I use sometimes. I use uh, Laura Geller sometimes, but this, I don't even know the name because it's rubbed off, but I use it a lot. Okay, I think it's L'Oreal. I'm gonna use this brush because it just, it just is easy to apply and it goes on quickly. So, I'm just gonna put this on the whole lid and it brightens it up. Now what I'm gonna have to do is I'm gonna have to get my little mirror, very handy, and scoot up so I can see what I'm doing. Okay, so. And let me put a little more on here. And do the other eye. Okay, see how that brightens up? All right, now I'm ready for my color. So here's a brush by It. I like this. It's got this side to do the under, under lid. I can use this to do the under lid, this to do the top part. I think I'm going to take the Laura Geller palette. I really like these colors. And I try to stay to the non-shimmer because as you get older, your lids are creepy. So I'm gonna tap that and here we go. Okay, so I'm just gonna get right to the corner and I'm gonna go all the way up to the corner of my eyebrow. Okay, then I'm going to bring it over and you see how I'm swiping that back and forth, back and forth. That's the way I blend. But I do a lot of tapping too, folks, because I have a lot of creepiness, so tapping just gets it in there really well. Now I'm going to do the other side. Tap that off. Take it from the corner and go all the way up. And now, I use a back and forth motion and a circular motion and a tapping motion. Okay, now I'm going to get a little bit darker color. So I'm going to go, this is really old. I've had this for a long time. This is Laura Geller and I am going to take a dark brown. But I'm just gonna barely, barely, barely tap it. I don't want too much. Okay. Let me get my little trusty mirror. Okay, so I'm just going to tap in that darker color, right? Right at the corner. Just give it a little depth. Okay, other side. And for me, this is kind of weird to put my makeup on, on, on like this. I don't use this little mirror. I use something, I use a big mirror. 
right, this will work. Okay, does that look even? I think it does. All right, so now I'm going to take this end right here and I'm gonna put it in that same dark color. And I'm gonna use this as liner. So if you can see me. And I'm gonna to want to bring it up into the corner. Do you see what I'm doing here? Now I use my finger. I use my fingers a lot, people. That's just what I like to do. Okay. Now I'm going to dip it in that dark color and do this side. If you're a beginner at this, honestly, this is not hard, folks. Just practice. And it's fun to put makeup on. I love doing it every day. Okay, so I keep it dark right at the corner because I have a lot of crepiness over there. Blend that in a little bit. Okay. All right, that looks good to me. Now, I'm gonna show you what I'm going to do. I didn't put any concealer on today, I just put makeup, but this is going to work for me. Okay, this is by Tarte. And I happen to love these colors. All of these colors are just fabulous. Why? They're matte, no shimmer. And for we old women, we need to use matte. You can use some shimmer if you want to. Sometimes I do. Okay, this is my favorite color right there, if you can see it. And that is Super Mom. Oh, huh, I like that, Super Mom. Never really looked at that before. Okay, so I'm gonna take the end of this little spongy brush and I'm going to dip it in here. I'm going to just do a little, well, I need my mirror because this, I think I could do it. Maybe not. Okay, so I'm gonna put a little highlight right here. Not too much, I'm just gonna tap it in. Do a little bit more down here. Okay, just to brighten up my eye, I'm going to place this right here. And I am going to blend, blend, blend. Okay. Now. Ladies, you're gonna like this. You know in the corner of your eyes, you know, you, it's kind of purplish. Well, guess what? You can get rid of all that. And I bring it down a little bit. Place it here. Kind of brightens up your eye. I like that. Okay, let's do the other side. Okay, I'm just gonna tap that in.
Okay, I'm just going to blend that in. Blend, blend, blend. Hmm. I think I need a little bit more on this side. I look cross-sided, don't I? <laughs> when I'm looking at myself, it's like, okay, I'm, I'm looking at myself and I'm cross-sided. Okay, so now we're going to take care of all this blue stuff. See all that? Let's take care of that. I kind of bring it up here because I have some broken veins, so I kind of carry it up a little bit on this eye. Go down where you see some darkness under my eyes. Oh, I still see a little bit. And that's okay. We're not here to be perfect, that's for sure. Boo. Okay. Now I take a brush and I always keep this clean because this is just kind of a blender and you're just gonna hardly even blend anything, but you're gonna blend a little bit. Okay. Now, What I forgot to get out, and I think it's right here. I don't always use it, but I like to use it sometimes. Okay, I forgot to get this. This just happens to be a brown eyeliner. It doesn't matter what brand you get. This just is natural Kahal, Kahal, Benekos. Okay, never heard of that, but I use it. And what I'm gonna do here, is just put it in the waterline. Because I don't do eyeliner. I used to when I was younger, but you know, as you get older, you just, you have to do what works for you. So I don't do eyeliner, I do it underneath. Okay, so that's that. Okay, so for eyelashes, I have several that I love, 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 but this is one that I really love. And it's called They're Real by Benefit. I really like this. I'll show you why. I want you to look at that. The tip is awesome. That's what gets your little lashes everywhere. And I just love the brush. So ladies, if you're looking for a great mascara, Always try to look at the brush to see what the brush looks like, because that's very important. Okay. So again, need to look in this little mirror to see what I'm doing. Okie doke. Eyelashes for me are important because it really opens up your eye. getting some of this mascara on my veins.
See how it gets these little tiny hairs down here? Who even thought? Okay, there's one eye. Let's get the other eye. See the difference? Mascara makes a big difference. Okay, folks, let's get this eye. My next tutorial, I believe I'm just going to do eyebrows. That's going to be a short tutorial because I don't make a big deal about my eyebrows. I want them to look very natural so I don't spend a lot of time on my eyebrows. Okay, so I did my mascara with just one dip for each eye. I didn't have to keep going in to get more. So I really recommend this. This is great. I love it. Okie doke. Okay, so last but not least, for we women who are seniors, we have crepiness under here. Well, guess what I use? It's been around for ages and it's called Sudden Change. I only use one drop that will take care of both eyes. But I don't leave home without it. Okay, I've got my one drop. That under your eyes. I have this little fan that just works wonders. I don't know if you can see it working, but I can feel it working. It's kind of sucking up everything. If you don't have a fan, it takes about a minute for it to do its job. Okay. So now, I'm ready to leave. Okay, folks. Bye.